Hi stampers, this is Dawn from DawnStippingThoughts.net and today's video we're going to make a envelope liner and I went ahead and made this card. We're going to make a card similar to this but using different colors tomorrow. So I'm going to show you how to make the envelope liner today. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're going to use the cherry on top and this is the designer paper stack and it looks like this. A lot of fun brightly colored designer but paper. But we're using this piece right, let me see if I can find it using this one right here, which I already tore one out. All right, so for the liner, we're gonna need your punch board and your paper trimmer, and then a ruler. Okay, so for my envelope, I made it to fit a standard size card, and I went ahead already and made the envelope. There's a video on this, on how to use the envelope punch board, but I went ahead already and made and that. And this size is cut at four and a quarter by five and a half, and that size is right here, four and a quarter by five and a half, so you'll need a piece of eight by eight piece of cardstock or designer paper. And then your first score line is gonna be at three and a half. All right, so I went ahead already and did that. So now I'm going to make a liner and I'm gonna take my ruler. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna measure the point of your envelope down to just below this score line right here, okay? So take your ruler, you're gonna measure right there and it comes to about four and a half right here, okay? Then you're going to cut your designer paper or your liner a quarter inch smaller. So we're gonna cut our designer paper at four and a quarter square. So I got my designer paper, and I got my paper trimmer, and we're just gonna cut this at four and a quarter by four and a quarter. And you want to keep these pieces for the card we're going to make tomorrow, okay? Okay, so next we're going to take our envelope punch board. And you'll notice on the envelope I rounded the corners, and there's a corner rounder right up here at the top. Just stick it in that little V shape there and punch down on the punch board. And we're going to take our designer paper, and you're going to line this up at four and a quarter. Okay, and you're going to punch. Okay, then you're going to flip it over and you're going to do the direct opposite side of the designer paper square. So just flip it over and line that up at four and a quarter and punch. Okay, so then we're going to go ahead and round the corner on this side. So it looks like this now. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and take our corner that's rounded right here. This is going to be the top of your envelope. And we're going to make a, like an imaginary line here. We're going to put adhesive on the top part only. Okay, and I'm going to show you why here in a second. I'm going to slide this in, and you're going to line these little grooves up over here to your envelope. It should go right below the score line, just like that. Okay, so now normally if you would have added adhesive to the inside part down here, when you fold your score line, this paper is going to move, and it might see it's already moving. I don't know if you can even see that, but once you fold that, since you didn't put adhesive on that section, it won't bunch up and lay flat. So that's how you make your envelope liner. Okay, thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you later. Bye!